We're going to do what's called a watercolor wash. It's a great way to get a sky in quickly. And so, uh, like I said, it's called a wash. So the first thing you want to do is get your paper wet. Like it's taking a bath. And we're just going to use a clean brush and clean water. And I'm going to get all the areas of the sky wet. And at this point, it's okay to work pretty loosely. And the skies are usually darker near the top. Uh, so if you have a nice blue sky, uh, you can start by putting a little bit of water on your color there and work your way down. I add a little more water on my brush and I just bring that pigment down. You can even tilt your paper a little bit. Now, I want to add, have those clouds on there, so I can actually take these towels, and they're not really absorbent, but you can go in and mop up some of that pigment. It's okay if some of that sky gets down on my shoe because that's going to make it look like it's up there in the mist at the top of the mountain. So I'm actually going to work on another area and I'm going to rinse my brush out and dry it here. I'm going to work out some of these down here. I kind of wanted them to look like the Smoky Mountains. So I'm going to go along like this. Use some water to bring that pigment down. So this paper's dry here, and that's the way I want it. You can see if you put a color on top of something wet, how that affects it there. It's pretty interesting. Now when that dries, I can come in and actually make a second layer of color on top. 